I'm Ahmed Rawat, a student in Mechanical Engineering in Cairo University. Uh, we are here today to talk about two topics. The first one is the social needs of our society and the second one is uh, the admission competencies. We will address four questions. The first question is what type of people our country needs. The problem in Egypt is that education quality is very low, so we need people that are well educated because education is a key for countries' development. We also need uh, people that are passionate towards themselves and their country and have that uh, potential to have a significant impact on the society. Values and attitudes of those people towards life, society and the world. We need the people to be proactive and act ethically and not to cheat. What are the skills and capacities that are necessary for that person? Someone which is open-minded and has the ability to learn from anyone without discrimination. The first and one of the most important skills is the leadership skill. The entrepreneur which seek opportunities and uh, try to be a problem solver for the progress of our country. And the final question is, what is the knowledge required for this the type of person? students amongst all people should be fully aware of their country's demographics and its economical state. They should also have the basic knowledge for all sciences, in addition to becoming pioneers in their own specialization. We settled on the four characteristics. The first one is to be a strong believer. He has to believe in what he's doing. He has to believe that his contribution is very important to the society. He can change the world. They have to be passionate about what they are learning. They must have the potential to improve and to make their studies better. His eagerness to learn. He has to be eager to learn. He has to overcome the external influences that may happen to him. That could be a great obstacle for him to continue his education. Like money, so awareness. He has to be aware of the country's current situation. The current situation, either demographically or economically, he has to set benchmarks for the development of the country. My pre-university education, it provided me with the general knowledge in basic sciences, which helped me to decide which faculty to join. Also, it taught me ethics and morals that I should follow in my life, and it showed me that their good merits. I wish I had learned more about economics, marketing, sales and accounting in my school or about programming and prototyping software as, as they are important for any industry. And uh, finally, thank you so much for watching this video and thanks to my colleagues who helped me to prepare this contribution.